Hello everyone, it is me, Brandon, and today I want to discuss about the Magicals from Magical Sanctum. So, as I am writing this, it is a Tuesday, which is the day before the new Magical comes, so let's just get started. Tomorrow will show or introduce the next new Magical from Magical Sanctum. I have been sensing a pattern, and the pattern is is that the new peer magical monsters resemble familiar monsters from the original singles and ethereal singles alike. First, we were introduced to our first new magical, Xister. People say Xister, but I say Xister. It is a confirmed obvious relative who resembles the ghast. Next, we got Knucklehead and Frondly, a tiki-like monster who resembles Noggin and Frondly a tree-like monster who resembles Toadjammer. I thought those were coincidences until we got another monster, which is Deja Jin. It does not seem obvious at first, but Deja Jin's sleeping animation resembles Grumpires, and they both primarily have arms. Like, yeah, just arms, no legs. And they also fly. Next, we got Larvalus. And this monster seems to be on the nose, but what I can say, it is similar to Humbug, but not resembles to the point that they are actually relatives. So far, all the magical hybrids from Magical Sanctum, not including Zister, resembles the single elementals, natural and ethereal alike, but aren't confirmed related or are related yet in some way. All right. As I am typing this, our current monster to be in Magical Sanctum is Kahoot, which is sounds similar to the game called Kahoot. So Kahoot is an owl slash stingray monster. When I saw and heard this animation song, I realized that it is a magical equivalent to Tweedle, who is a bird monster who flies. All right, I got all the monsters grouped together of what they resemble or equivalent to. So we obviously have the Gazd and the Xister. Obviously, because they are confirmed obvious relatives. And then we got Knucklehead and Noggin. They both have like these underbites and they both play the percussion and like their eyes are similar. Which I think they're like eyelids. But they use their hands to make percussion. And they both have markings. And then we got Frondly and Toe Jammer. It seems obvious with the toes. And maybe the mouth. Which you don't see in this picture because this is like its normal form or stage. I don't know. And then... We got Larvalus and Humbug, and they don't really seem to be exactly alike, but what I can say, they are invertebrates. Plus they play instrumentals, and then we got the Tweedle and the Kahoot. They seem to be like different species, but they both sing, they fly, and Kahoot is supposed to be like an owl-like monster even though it's primarily a stingray. And those horns, all right? See those horns right there? And the ears of the Tweedle? Yeah, that is so alike. And I'm gonna go to Grumpire and Deja Jin, but I gotta get that picture because I forgot to add it into this computer or laptop. My apologies for not having Grumpire or Deja Jin in the picture of the other Magicals and Single Elementals. So, to make it up, I got them both side by side. Let's talk about the similarities. So, Grumpire and Deja Jin, they can fly. And they can sing. And, also, they got spots. And they have arms. That kind of seems about it. Oh yeah, they both have bags. 
Alright, that's what I think that's it. You can tell me more similarities if you, like, found some. You can say in the comments, alright? And I'll check them out. And I'm going to go now. Magical disappearance, and I hope we see that magical the next day.